Coming up this week on Archer's <laughs> Choice. Wait, That's a big buck. Oh, <laughs> <buddy. laughs> He's a good one. Welcome, Welcome to this week's Archer's Choice. And yes, we saved the best whitetail for last. That's right, North Dakota Double B Outfitter with the Brant Brothers. The Brants. We love them up there. Oh, they're incredible. You they betcha, are. my gosh, I'm oh, telling you. Geez, oh, jeez, Oh, jeez, Vicky, hey, you know. this week's lucky logo. This is the ultimate hit em where it hoits, baby. That's right, so at the end of the show, we'll let you know what to do with A the, new the Hoyt bow and all kinds of goodies from all the other sponsors. Really? Yo, oh, We got so much to show. I mean, every year we go up there with John and David and Susie. Oh, yeah, 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 you know, Vicky, we yeah. do some deer hunting and some duck hunting, and it's always really good. We actually broke out the Benelli's and we powdered some, some waterfowl. Some waterfowl. Hey, yes. we got a lot to show though, so we should we do. with Tommy G. Tommy G's in the Is blind first. first. First night out, well, don't pass. Don't let them walk, Tom. Well, we are pumped because we are here with Double B North Dakota, baby, and it's about to happen right now. So lick this or stand and then sign yes. across it. Yes, sir. They're just playing with you. What? You have to do it. You have to This is going to be good. Wait. Wait, let me see it. What's your name, sir? <laughs> I trust you. Do I lick this thing? Yes, you yes, do. I, I believe you. <laughs> I put that right here, right? No. It was the first day up there at Double B Outfitters and Tommy G is getting settled in his ground blind. Dan, the cameraman, is all right set up next to him. And wouldn't you know it, the very first buck they see is a solid shooter. Dave's just pulling up now. We can hear the truck, so we're going to get out, give him a quick uh, story, let him know exactly how it happened and what time, and discuss a little bit and decide if we're going to get on this deer or wait until the morning and come back and look for him then. So. Was he? Was he right? Yeah, he was close. Perfect. Very close. Cool. Right, what we need. Whoa, 
Come. Oh, oh. We were gonna take yeah, right. that sooner or later, huh? Wow. How about that? Unbelievable. Oh, yeah. Good him. job. Oh, thank you. Thank God, you. he's a dandy. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah. He's gonna he's he's gonna do he's, he's gonna, gonna do be well way for over you. 150. He's gonna he's gonna do well for you. This is tremendous. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks very much. This is wonderful. I mean, and when he was standing up, he's just so tall back there. And I just got so excited when I saw him. Beautiful. That Spitfire saved me. Yeah. Because I was aiming right here. Yeah. And I just pushed it a little bit. Isn't that something? Perfect. Yes, it is. Perfect. That is a tremendous broadhead. Boy, that is quite a deer. Isn't that great? Oh, geez, that's a dandy Tom. Oh, you betcha, Tommy. <laughs> that was, I think that was Tom's probably best buck with his bow. I think so. Congratulations. He and hit now, it where it hoited. It's your turn. <laughs> it's my turn. That's oh, right. Boy. Let's see how you can do. Z and I are in the blind. Okay, this is the second night of our on here with Double B. Uh, we're in North Dakota. We've got a warm front that moved in, I think, just for today. Give us a south wind. We're in a box blind. And we are absolutely super close to a bedding. You know, we've got these deer all around us and they're coming through, they're coming out. We are very close to one of the bedding areas. The wind's in our favor and all of a sudden you start seeing the bucks come out and Z and I are like, yeah, baby, yeah. And they're getting bigger and bigger and you're like, oh my gosh. And you know, you're waiting and here it is. And just all of a sudden, you know, you start seeing some of what we call the toads. And well, this big boy walks out right before and it was, well, you'll see. Listen, learn from my mistakes. You know, I got in that box blind and I couldn't see my pin and you can't use a lighted sight in North Dakota. So you've got to deal with that and we should have been more prepared for that. We can't just easily turn that little light on in, in some states. So make sure you get away from those really small, small, you know, diameter pins. Go to a larger pin when you know that you're going to be in a structure or a ground blind that's super dark. That is your bow hunting world tip of the week. Listen, it wasn't pretty, okay? I mean, we had that big fork buck you saw, you, you yeah. were telling us about, yeah. you were seeing? He was coming in, and I was like, oh yeah, oh yeah, I want him. And as he's coming in, this heavy eight came, and he just pushed them all out. They were going that way. You know what I mean? They went that way. And then all of a sudden, I said, oh, shooter, shooter. And he comes right in here. I come to full draw, I come down, and I come down, I couldn't, my pin, because it's so dark, I couldn't see it. So I lift it up, I bring it back down, and I panic. I'm like, oh, I can't see it. And as I'm, as I'm just gonna come back over to, to get my head on him, 
I pulled through, I hit him. And I was like, I was, I was a, I was a nervous wreck. You know what I mean? And it was just, wait, wait. That's a big buck. Oh, but. I know he is. <laughs> he's a good one. My, look yeah. at this buck. Oh, he's a, he's a big. <laughs> Double B, baby. Look at the eye guards. He's a, he's a dandy. Oh, 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 my. He's a dandy. Look at this deer. Oh, my goodness. This is a monster. You know, you could travel far. Iowa, Kansas, and you, Illinois. They got nothing on North Dakota, guys. This buck is a monster wherever you would go. And the branch, double B, the action is huge. Congratulations. Okay, time out, all right? I came down on him, I couldn't see the pin. Yeah. I came up, I came back down. And I, I got started getting a little nervous because I couldn't see it, you know what I mean? Because yeah. it was too dark. And when I came up, I the blind I, was too I, dark I, to see yeah. your pin. Gotcha. I sort of I, I I hit him where it hoit for sure, but he went down. Yeah, he no, really no trailing. Went down. No, no. That was good. And that's what they said they wanted. They didn't want him to get back to a bedding area. Yeah. Okay. So I, I perfected <laughs> that shot. Full of baloney. Oh my god. Last year was my first opportunity to come up to Double B's Lodge and hunt with Ralph and Vicky and John and David and the, and the gang. Um, I was thrilled to have the opportunity to come back again. It's, it, it's such an outstanding group and um, down-to-earth people that just make you feel comfortable as soon as you walk up to camp. It's just unbelievable. John and David, they say, oh, you know, we're not going to have a good hunt. It's this and this and this. And every time I come, it's absolutely outstanding. Like, it's, it's a ton of fun and there's lots of birds. Now we're going to join Vicky, but before she gets out, well, mm -hmm. every year we're up there, it's the same it's time. It's always David's, David's birthday. birthday. So we thought we'd share the birthday party. And I think with the young you. man just turned 35, 36. Yes, oh, you brown nose. Absolutely. Oh my gosh. It was David's birthday yesterday, and Ralph has decided that we need to make him a birthday cake, except for that we didn't know what kind of birthday cake we should make. So Ralph's great idea is to take a chocolate thing of ice cream and a vanilla thing of ice cream, stick it in a couple pie plates, and we're going to decorate it, and we're going to let him know that we got him a new tractor for, per for his birthday. Perfect. Isn't that nice? The balloon blower's over there. You want to lick that off there? I'll make like a tractor. Oh, yeah. We got moose dropping and deer dropping cakes. Perfect. If you've never had a roll-up here at Double B, you are missing out. It's much better on you than that. To get everything ready. And we are heading out. It's our last night here at Double B. Ralph, we scored his buck this morning. 182, which is going to be really hard for me to beat. So I think I'm just going to not worry about beating that and just get me a buck. <laughs> Thank you.
So I spent a lot of time in the ground blind and we're sitting there and waiting and we're watching just a ton of really good bucks. Over to the right, they're about two, 300 yards away from us. Nothing's coming close to us. And we're just zoned, staring in that direction the whole time. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, out of the left that we can't see, this buck comes out and he almost startled me. drugs, alcohol, anything. Right there. <laughs> it's a trend like baby. <laughs> Thank you, sweetie pie. Must have been your lucky kiss. Let's go. He was standing right here. I'll try to find it. And he ran that way. He ran out that way. RJ gotta stay on the blood. There's blood here. Arrow. Arrow. Good job, buddy. Buddy. <laughs> Good job, RJ. Oh, oh, oh. Right. <laughs> Look at that. Look at him. Oh, oh my. Isn't he beautiful? He's a dandy. Look at him, huh? Isn't he a beautiful buck? <laughs> RJ, my little man. Thank you for that lucky kiss. Yeah, he's really wide. He's got to be close to 20 inches wide. Yeah, but all I saw was white times. Sure. I was like, oh my God, I should grab my bow. I was like, okay, <laughs> I'm not hesitating. He he's made a perfect shot. I know, I made a great shot on you him. See that right through the lungs. Thank you, John. <laughs> You're welcome. Last night here at Double B Outfitters, and look at what I got a beautiful 10. Way to go, Vic. I mean, Thank can you, you believe it? And last day, almost last hour. We're and watching all them deer on the We right. were waiting he on the radios up. to get the call. We got the call. We hurried up. RJ, RJ all of us took with, off and, recover. to recover he, that. Another that great so buck. Cool. You know, we want to thank the branch so much because yes. we've started with them and it, 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 the hunting keeps getting better. It is. And I mean, every year we go up there, ducks and bucks. This year we had Delta up there again with us, Carly and the. Those Benelli's make so, a big difference. They do. Oh. We, we just have so much fun, and every year we go up there, and it's like going back home. It's just like family. It is. Thank you, know, you guys so much for letting us And Sharon David's there. birthday, he's 35, Stop. John's 26, Susie's 22. He's really brown nosed, and you guys, you know, my gosh. If you happen to see Lucky Logo, which was Hoyt. Hit him where Hoyt's. Log on to archerschoice.com, click on Lucky Logo button, and someone's going to have a some new goodies bow, and a new plus bowl. a lot of other good stuff, so don't forget about that. So now listen, next week starts all new shows. All no new reruns, shows. all new shows. Cool. And we want to thank the sponsors for supporting us all and these years. And believing in us. And you guys for watching us for all these Because without all of you, none of this is possible. That's right. And that's right. guy upstairs. So once again, thank you so much. And we can't wait to start sharing all these new shows with you. Right. Right and, here. And if you're missing us, you can go to Facebook.com slash oh. Ralph and Vicki and follow us because we're on it all the time. She's, the phone's attached to her hip. It's not worth filming. I get yelled at for that. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next week. Same time. Same channel. Right here with all new shows. All new.